Hey yo, it's Brian here today. Gonna be talking about the San Francisco 49ers as always doing another top three video. This time talking about the three things you should be looking forward to for this game against the New York Giants on Monday Night Football. Should be a fun one. We get another primetime game. Hopefully Nick Mullins and company can show that they can do a good job on the national stage again against the Giants. Yes, I know the Giants are really not that good. They have a lot of dysfunction within their organization, but still we have to play who we play on the schedule. So yeah, going to be talking about that. But before I do, please like and subscribe to support my channel. That would definitely help me out a lot. Let's do it. Let's kick some butt. The top three things you should be looking forward to for this game against the New York Giants Monday Night Football. Coming in at number three, this is kind of a two-parter for the defense, but for the first part, I'm going to be mentioning takeaways and sacks. So hopefully the 49ers can replicate what they did against the Oakland Raiders on Thursday night where they pressured Derek Carr and made his life a living hell in the pocket, sacking him about five or six times, hitting him quite a bit. I hope they can keep the pressure up against the Giants. Also, interceptions, takeaways like that, fumbles, I hope they can do that as well because the 49ers are kind of low in that department. They only have like two interceptions as a team the whole year. That's like in the bottom of the league. League. They need to really improve on that. And I think they can because Eli Manning is prone to make mistakes. His O-line is really not that good. So he has to kind of throw the ball kind of fast, throw away the ball a couple of times. I hope they can take advantage of that, take advantage of this terrible Giants O-line. I think they can. So hopefully we see that. If they can, then they'll blow the Giants out like they did against the Raiders if they can keep pressuring Eli Manning and create takeaways. Coming in at number two, I had the defense trying to stop Saquon Barkley. Now, in my prediction video, I kind of neglected to talk about him for whatever reason. Maybe I forgot about him. Maybe because the Giants suck. There's no point in mentioning him. But yeah, Saquon Barkley, he's a freaking beast. He's the only reason why the Giants are pretty much watchable in 2018. And he has a bright future in the NFL. So far... You know, that's pretty much the only bright spot that they have. If the 49ers can pretty much stop him, stop the running game, then pretty much everything else is going to fall down for the Giants. And the only other threat I can see for the Giants offensive side of the ball is Odell Beckham. But even then, Eli Manning likes to make a lot of mistakes. So I don't know if I can trust Manning that much. But yeah, if they can stop Saquon Barkley, then they will stop this offense completely. So yeah, please stop Saquon Barkley, San Francisco defense. Before I get to the number one thing you should be looking forward to for this game against the Giants, want to do a quick honorable mention. Going to be mentioning our receivers. Yes, the 49ers receivers. I think that they're going to have a pretty big day like they did against the Raiders. George Kittle, I would love to see more Richie James. I think a lot of you guys are excited to see this little man play more in the slot and what have you. And he had a pretty big day against Oakland last week. So yeah, please, San Francisco receivers. I think you guys can have a big day, especially with Nick Mullins. Let's make it happen. Coming in at number one as the biggest thing you should be looking forward to for this game against the New York Giants on Monday Night Football is our quarterback, Nick Mullins, and his second start. So yeah, this guy is the reason why everyone is so energized to watch some 49 football again. You know, I was kind of depressed watching them before Mullins made his start against the Raiders. Yes, I know it's against the Raiders, but still, he had a really awesome debut performance, and I think he can keep it up against the New York Giants this Monday night just because the Giants are a pretty bad team for the most part. I think that the team can take advantage of that. Please, Mullins, try to replicate your performance like you did against the Raiders, and all will be good leading to the bye week. And if you guys win this game, then I can relax for the next two weeks until we come back to play Tampa Bay at Tampa Bay. That's pretty much it, you guys. You know, I trust Nick Mullins in this game. I'm pretty sure all you guys can trust Mullins in this game. And hopefully he has a good performance. Everything can go good. Please let me know what you guys are looking forward to for this game against the Giants. Do you guys have any final predictions? Do you guys have anything else to say about this game? Please, i like to hear what you guys have to say. And if you guys like this, please like and subscribe to support my channel. That would definitely help me out a lot. And yeah, I'll catch you guys up probably after the Monday night game against the Giants. I'll see y'all then. Bye, guys. Love y'all. Y'all have a good rest of your weekend. See you guys after the game. Go Niners.